What's going on, you guys? It's me, Kyle here, and so we finished the we finished the top three missions of the game. So now we're gonna do the final two. And if you liked part one of the top five, I'll do another another top five of the game because we, face it, we have plenty of missions on here. So the first five was prologue. Number four was Dead Man Walking. Number three was M Monkey Business. And number two is... Wait for it. Wait for it. It is... It is... Where is it? wrap up. This is number two. Enjoy. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> How do I get in this place? No stairs. Fingers hurt. Here. And it's not because of gaming. Here. Oh my gosh, it's taken forever! Okay. Alright. Ah, hey, maybe that's why we're such great friends, huh? We're old school, we like old fashioned things, like newspapers, celluloid. Good guys, bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know, you tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said. And cut me loose, right? Things are not going to work out quite that way. There's a bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy, you can say that. Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox. I'm but fucking orthodox! <laughs> you've ruined my career! Agent Sanchez, arrest these men both. Oh, Steve, oh whoa, whoa, please. Are you fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well, let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because. Because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business dealings, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend a suspect! Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael, to try and explain things to him. Not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. After you, buddy. Come on, where's the trust? You could do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. Put the weapons down, boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American action. Put your weapons down, all of you. Who the fuck are you with? A bank. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the weapons down. Fuck you! We all know you agency boys are all deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Put the gun down, gentlemen! Who the fuck are they? Fucking Merriweather! What are they doing here? See, put your gun down. <laughs> oh, see, goddamn way! <laughs> oh. oh, fuck! Bullshit. Yeah, it 
this bullshit.
you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three-way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me. Huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full of the fucking brim with bullshit low rent hood. Listen, Trevor, listen, I've been meaning to... Uh, you know, I've been meaning to... <laughs> I have been meaning to tell you, you know, I mean, what, homie, what do you have meaning to tell me, huh? That you stabbed me in the back, or that you were, and always will be, a worthless wretch who deserves to be put under. Yeah, well, no, what the fuck, fuck did you come day? back for? Oh, you know why. No, oh, no, no, no. One last score. Mm-hmm. And if it goes good, guess what? I don't want to have to put a little bullet in your head, but... That goes bad. Well, that's okay, too. Because then, you and I get to go to hell. And I get to spend the rest of eternity with you, tormenting you. Well, I guess it's on. <laughs> yeah, I guess it is. Call Lester. Let's go. On speakerphone. Hey, it's me. I know. How'd it go? Just fabulous. Ran into an old friend. Matter of fact, you saved my ass. Oh, we're all friends now. Was the group hugs out of the question? <laughs> he wants to uh, still go on the final victory tour. All right, when it looks like it's a go, I'll contact you. And remember this, gentlemen. If we pull this off, we will be making history. Sorted, nasty, depraved history. But history, nonetheless. All right. There. You happy? Fucking thrilled. <laughs> Don't forget, amigo. Keep my eye on you. Yeah. Mm. Now we're gonna do number one. Boy, a four headshots. Uh. Mm. Can't see. There we go. <laughs> okay, how much time do we have? Fourteen minutes, almost fifteen. Oh, excuse me. What time is it? Almost five o'clock. Yeah. yeah. I'm sure we can squeeze in one more mission. <laughs> uh, damn. I gotta go to bed. I mean, it's five a.m. Huh. I'm dead. Yes. <laughs> All right. I don't like Tanya. It has nothing to do because she's black. Okay. It has nothing to do with it. It's just I, I don't know. Just don't really like her character. I think she uh, uses Frank. You know, Frank Franklin. Ugh, can't even speak. <laughs> Spaghetti mouth. <laughs> okay, and number five. Is the big score. That is number five, one of my favorite missions. And if you look at my YouTube channel, I did make the big score, but I would do it again because I like it. I love it. I want some more of it. Uh huh. <laughs> All right. To uh, recap, these are our options. We try to make them give us the gold, or we drill a big old hole in the side of the bank and we take it out. The bank? If you're drilling a big old hole, you'll need a big old drill, a tunnel bore machine. I'll locate it, but you have to steal it and store it near the bank. They're excavating a new part of the metro network around there, so that's where you'll go in. We'll need choppers for the getaway, too. If Trevor has one we can use, the other can be bought. The guys on the ground will need a getaway car, so get something fast and tough, and then modify it as much as you can to increase your chances of getting away from the cops. And it's got to be stored in a parking garage near the UD. Uh, it's going to be a lot of heat, so think about that. Um, or I'm forgetting something. Uh, oh, that's it. <laughs> we'll need a train to land the gold on and take it to the warehouse. You'll have to steal it. Uh, again, I'll send you the details. Now, if you're interested in the more, um, you've got to get... Uh, what... Yeah, yeah, we are okay. now. Michael, subtle or obvious, what's it going to be? 
Okay. Um, I have to change my battery because. Eh, all right. Because shit for brain controllers. Just... Okay. All right. And he's looking at dirty sights. All right. Stop the 
Number one highest in Grand Theft Auto 5. The big score. Push through! Help set the bridge across off the street! Come on, this is a game to me! Come on! Where'd all the news guys go? Is there another robbery?
Team, I think we're in the clear. You doing all right? We got company! Looks like Merriweather! Oh, shit. That is the top five of all the heists. And it is 515. Hmm. Anyway, we scored half. But that is the top five, and I will probably do more of the top five later. But those are my top favorites. What are yours? Leave your comments below. And if you want me to do part two of the top five, let me know. Which I'll probably do anyway, so even if you do let me know, I'll probably do it anyway, so. Yeah, I just want to show you my top five heists of Grand Theft Auto V, the story. So yeah. Later, guys.